What up, what up, what up, YouTube? Back again with another video. My goodness. This is an epic game. Epic. Epic. He would have made it better if my opponent just called better plays, like more than one play. <laughs> it really made it an interesting game. But nonetheless, it was still one of those heart pumping games. Back and forth, back and forth to whoever wins, wins. So he gets the ball here first, and I get introduced to this play. It's a good play. It's just like I said, people just know how to vary the play. You got to have more than one play. You can't just run one play all game. So here's the play right here that gets running the Saints fork. It's a good play. But he just decides to run the whole game. So I'm like, all right, go ahead, man. If he mix it up, he could really beat me, like beat me down. But it's like I know it's coming, so it's just a matter of trying to stop it. And, you know, Drew Brees just got me up and down the field. You know, but with plays like this, once you get him in the red zone, that's where he starts struggling. It never fails once they get in the red zone. So you just like let them do what they do, and when they get in the red zone, just you shut it down. Right here, I put Krakowski on a yellow zone. I'm blitzing uh, Fuller on the outside on the left. So he thought that guy on the outside was going to run that inside post. But Krakowski was like, I don't think so. Give me those. Give me those. See? It was set up perfectly. I just ignored the outside guys by saying Kyle Fuller on the blitz. Put him in the yellow zone. He was playing the purple. I mean, uh, he was playing the, he was supposed to be blitzing, but I put him in the yellow hook. And I knew he was going to throw that post behind him. Picked it off. I will turn him over. Let's see if we can score. Let me hit him with this play here. Down outside. And juke move. And Cohen is off to the races. Catch me if you can. Oh, where'd that guy come from? Leave him in our smoke. Touchdown, Bears. All right, we up seven zip. He probably made a mistake on that interception by going too early, anticipating something was going to be there, and it wasn't. So I already know I'm going to get a heavy dose of that play again. It's probably no huddle. So I'm still coming out of the same play again. Put the Kuska on the yellow hook. And that's the benefit of this play because you have this high low thing that he has going on. If I play over the top coverage and take over the top away, you just dump it up to his tight end. So it creates a dilemma for me. Because he could really just do that all the way up game. See, take him out this time, and then he goes to the top. And it's like a high low read for this guy. And like I said, the only reason why they were able to see that happening because the way the, the game was in the beginning of the year, when you just like you can just rush four and get pressure, it forces you to blitz all the time. And I don't want to blitz all the time, but I have to blitz all the time. That's the only way I'm going to get pressure in this game. To keep nerfing stuff, like just leave it alone. I don't know who's complaining about the rushing, but now you see it, it's affecting everybody. Everybody is just, you know, everybody is, is Drew Brees now. Everybody can like quarterback because you can sit in the pocket literally the whole day and throw the ball. And then you try to use aggressive pass rush, and then you get called offside. It's just kind of like you can't win. You know what I mean? You can't win. Like, what's the point of having it when you can't even use it? So, I mean, the game is still fun. Some stuff still happens that still gets you excited. Right here. Probably should have run committed. I probably stopped him in the backfield. But, man, this guy right here is how to bring down. Um, Kamara. I go that. All right, gotta get back in. Red zone defense. Can't give up nothing here. Who's it throwing to? Who's it throwing to? It's underneath. You bring him down. It's gotta be another play. I don't see this play. They can be running the ball. Oh. Think, I'm thinking he's gonna run it. He's gonna run. Yeah, he is running it. I thought he was running this play a lot of times in here. Because he just took his hands off of the accelerator button and just <laughs> guided him up. Trying to blitz up the middle so he can catch him. Yeah, I, yeah, I mean, I'm running again. Yep. So he knows he's not going to do his one play. All right, good for him. Alright, he got another set of first downs. Goodness. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Get him out of here. Get him out of here. Come on, man. Jeez. See, I'm telling you, man, I can't even use this thing. 
Everybody does it. It just keeps freaking freak snapping, trying to throw you off sides. Like this should set the pass rush into how it is when you're aggressive rush and just leave it there as as the default. And we don't even need any coaching adjustment. Cause what's the point? You can't even use it. Jeez, oh, every time you try to use it, you call look at that. That penalty is what cost that touchdown because I had him I had him and I lost yards. So I right, was able to Oh, it didn't tie the game up. It's still upright. Alright, seven six. Let's see if we can score here. Yeah, he played some pretty good D. I don't know if he was rushing all the time, but I was feeling the heat. I was feeling the pressure. When people play double A gap against me, sometimes it seems they they know what they're doing. It could work really well. When I try to use this, like I have problems sometimes. Oh, look at oh. Right. Just dropped the pass. It was a good pass. He dropped it. Jeez. Catch the ball. In this right, X was open, but the rush, the blitz got me. I should have thrown the X. Because he chased after my run back. X open. X open. Uh. See, that's what happens when you blitz a lot, man. You force people to make quick decisions like that. Here, good read on, on his defense. He is disguised as man, but it's actually uh, cover two. But it looks like man, but it's actually cover two. And I call it correctly. But I need to get to game mode. Oh, you have to just hold on to the ball, man. Like, just hold on to the ball. Like, this shouldn't be a drop to me. I don't think this is a drop. That's not a drop, man. Come on, man. Stuff like that kills drives. Of course, we'd have to hold them on defense again. Murray like playing pretty tough. He's still using the strip mechanic, I mean, uh, the strip uh, coaching adjustment. I just try to strip it myself. I just every time I tackle, I try to hit R1 to try to get this to fumble myself. Because using it sometimes gets called for 15-yard face mask penalties. Like I said, another thing you can't even use. Ah, uh, he got me here. I'm supposed to be manning the tight end. Oh, the tight end got me. Close down. <clears throat> Still blitzing from the outside. That was on the screen. Oh, no, he that went all the way. Second and goal. Is he going to run it again? Let me see. No passing. Give me those. Give me those. He's trying to throw it in the back of the end zone. Mm -mm. Watching it this time. I don't think so. I right, turn him over. Yeah, he was hitting me with his double A gap right here. I think I was, I was starting, this is when I realized I'm throwing too much. Because he's, he's going to straight up pass defense and ignoring the run now because I've totally sold out on the run, I mean on the pass. So after this possession right here, I was like, alright, I got to put the ball on the ground. I don't care how much I gain, I got to put, I got to let him fear the run. Because he's just, yeah, he's just a full on pass defense now. I can't successfully make every read. <laughs> Here, bad read. Oh, up the, all the way down the middle of the field. It's wide open. I try to hit uh, White over here. I'm going to put him on a, on a screen route, post route. Run to the inside. And But oh, screaming down the field, wide open. Not wide open, but he beat his man. That's where the ball should have been. Look, look, look. Look, wide open. I should have tested that instead of throwing it underneath here. Alright, nonetheless, he stops me because he had three timeouts, and see, I should have ran. Now the ball's on his 44 yard line. Look at this. See? I mean, it's a good play. I can't really lie. I don't mind even going to look for the play and using it. It's a pretty good play. But to run it all the time, it's like you, you're, gonna, you're just going to let me see it eventually. Eventually, I'm just going to be like, all right, I know what you're doing, and it's going to get stopped. You can't give it to me every single down. All right, so good. We're keep running. Look, this should be picked. Should be picked. Oh, dropped interception. All right, just got to keep on the end zone. 
We all know that move. Catch the ball on the screen and you guys act like you're quicksand. All right. Force him to the field goal. Seven and nine. I get the ball to half. I'm going to switch up my game plan, my play calling style. I'm going to put more run, more call, more run plays. Just to keep it balanced because he was, like I said, he sold out on the pass and he wasn't even trying to play the run anymore. Come on, 646. That is your man right there. The block still. It's still in patch that still in the patch. He said they added more run block, I mean, more uh, black animations. I got him on the same thing he got me on. All right, tight end. Aha. Uh -huh. Trying to strip me. I don't think so. The same thing he got me on. All right. If he had a run, got to keep, keep him honest. I don't care what I gain, just keep the guy honest. Get off me. Yep, just keep him honest. Run the ball, run the ball. I'm going to come out here and just play pass defense all day. Good blocks now, finally. Jeez, that's what he's supposed to block. <laughs> that's how you block. I'm trying to disguise my run, but he started manning. Look at that. He manned up and he moved the safety over to the middle. So I'm going to switch plays here. I was going to run the ball at first, but now I'm going to pass. Block my tight end, and I'm waiting for wide upfield. Look at that. He just moved the safety all the way to the middle now. So it's man to man on the outside. And there he goes. There goes that man. Man, the best thing that's happening in my Madden football this year is Kevin White changed the whole, my whole offense. He changed my old offense. He's like a big, physical wide receiver that's fast. And I can gash you over the top. You don't really see me call Robinson's name that much. I mean, Robinson's good route running. He can get me like yards up the field. But when I want to go deep, you better watch out. Oh, come on, man. I just freaking had a beautiful drive, and then this garbage happens. You saw my guy try to tackle him, and they hit him to the outside and got him open. You do all that work, and the kickoff return just kills it for you. I gotta go back to the drawing board. Like he already knows the kind of plays I like to call now because I just switched up on him. So I gotta figure out if I'm gonna get the ball off field again. Try to go for a conversion. See, he's throwing the back of the end zone. He's gonna give me those. Give me those. <laughs> I'm watching those, man. I'm throwing in the back of the end zone. What are you thinking? All right. See, he already knows the run plays now. So I threw that switch it up on him that last drive. So there you go. Couple of yards here. Hey, but I'm still running though. So you gotta keep him honest. A little call up play action. Change my play calling style a little bit. Gotta keep him honest, man. He just can't keep selling out on double A gap blitzing. Ooh, not a lot of it. Thank you. Goes down. Take what he gives. Take what he gives. Just trying to disguise it. I'm thinking I'm running to the left, but he didn't move. Ah, uh, that would have been a good run. They should just throw in the X. Oh, just throw in the X. Oh, look at O. I just run out the pocket first down. Hey, I'll take those any days. I'll take those any day. I will take those any day. Because I'll fumble, of course. Try to draw more sides, and they got a 15 yard penalty. I mean, a uh, five yard penalty. False start. Play oh, look at the top. See? Run, you see how running changes everything now? Yeah, now he's changing the way he play calls. Look at, oh, come on, R1 is open. He's it down. All right, I got third down now. Third down at 15. I'm trying to run it here because he had his defense so wide open, but I got, up, I got hung up on the line. All right, fourth and was it 13? It's bad play calling. Well, not bad play calling. His defense just made plays. He just made plays. That batter ball on second down to get in first down. Oh, it's wide open, but took forever to get in the middle of the field. Dude, get in the middle of the field already. All right, still down one. We're in the fourth quarter now. Two yards on the team on our shoulders will lead the way, right? No doubt about it. And let me tell you, if you're a running back, all you want to do is get behind those big fellas. Still bad. We just got to just keep him out of the end zone. We're going to stay in this game. We can't score a touchdown. We can't allow a touchdown. On first and ten. On first and ten. Oh. Switched. Switched. Uh, 
The whole mission's on me. That's one with three wide receivers. Ooh, look at that. Come on. That's a pick, man. <laughs> that is a pick. I had him on the cover two blitz. That's a pick. I forced him to throw early again. Mission is still to keep him out of the end zone. Blitzing from the outside. Let's see if we keep him out. Hmm. Nobody open. Throws it away. Throw it down. Come on, guys. One stop. We can do this. One stop. One stop. Yes. Knock it down. All right. Force the field goal. Yes. All right. Come on, offense. Defense held up there in the bargain. We got all on our end of the bargain. On a touchdown in the other direction, all of a sudden they're down. On the return, it's Tariq Cohen. Uh oh, uh oh, Tariq Cohen up the middle. Tariq Cohen. Tariq Cohen, go! Thank you. Finally learned to celebrate. I'm talking about throwing the stands. Payback for payback. Got one back. All right, two minutes and fifty-one seconds left. Drew Brees, you know, Drew Brees doing Drew Brees things, trying to gain the end zone. I'm still watching the time. As long as we can tackle him out of bounds, be great. Switch formations on us now. Yeah, switch formations. Ah, oh, come on, dude. You had him. We just let him go. I don't think he's being mindful of the time. He's just trying to get up there and score. Yep. Kind of this sort of kind of covered this time. Oh, come on! Dang, went in there. Look at that. Two guys. Oh, that hurts. Dang, that hurts. Probably gonna run the ball here. Yep. Late handoff. Not too many warning. We're still fighting though. I keep him out. When this happened, I was like, should I let him just score? But I didn't want to give up the touchdown. So he's, he's run the clock down. The toss. And he gets in the end zone. All right, got a minute and 17 seconds left. One timeout. And New Orleans celebrating on me. Come on, Trubisky. Can you channel it? Come on, Trubisky. And this is what they work on. Every week in practice, usually on a Friday, they go first and ten. Situation, late game situation. What are we going to do? Let's go. Oh, I don't know more timeouts. No more timeouts. No more timeouts. Yeah, they have the now. Come on There's back. Oh, that is oh I'm still in bounds. Right, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. That hurry up. Hurry up. Get to the line. I really want to catch that and get out of bounds, but we can get out of bounds. Oh, X. All right, regroup here. Complete pass. Good formations. Let's see what this is. Oh, we got a star going outside. Here it comes. Oh, boom! Knocks it down. Got one right away across wide open. Switch for missions here. I think he plans to. Yes, it's cover four. All right, let's see if we can get him on this one. Oh, got him on the outside. Good throw. Get out of bounds. Save some time. 40 seconds left. That doesn't always happen with Trubisky. All right, first and ten. What we got? Switch the plays up. Got high low on the left side. Rush. Oh, look at all upfield. Good play. Hurry up. Hurry up to the line. Hurry up. Hurry up. Hurry up to the line. See if we can get him in here. Snap it. Oh, look at the box. Throw it. Oh, I should have thrown it earlier. He's wide open. All right. Let's go down to our goal line play. See if we can get him. Oh, 
shot from the six yard line, and it's second and goal now. He put his two middle line guys in coverage. Come on, Kevin. Get him in the back of the end zone. You can do this. This, this is unexpected. I've been running this all game, so it's going to be a surprise right here. Yeah, I'm doing double double slants on the left side in case. If I wanted to throw this slant to Robinson, I got to throw it as soon as I snap the ball. Like right now, throw it. But I got, oh, in the back of the end. Touchdown. Ah. Touchdown. There we go. Slow down for you. Look at R1 too was open. Oh man, I was I was selling out to him all the way. I was like, you gotta come through for me. The back of the end zone. That's putting a dagger in him. I can just see him just drop the controller right there. He had everybody in coverage. It was only rushing two, and I still managed to hit him in the back with all the heartbreaks. Even with the the kickoff return he had. Still able to fight through with a minute and 17 seconds. Put the dagger in. No, you got, look at this. Look at this. Almost caught it. Like, really? I was like, that's it, man. I ain't taking no more risk. <laughs> Putting everybody back there. What in the hell just happened just now? Put five guys back there. Try to run a five receiver screen. We bring him down. Yeah, that's it, man. Woo! Another tough one. Down to the wire. We able to prevail. All right, guys. If you got any questions, man, as usual, man, hit me up in the comment section. If you're new to my channel, man, go ahead and hit that subscribe button for me one time. Bang! Woo! That was a good one. Trubisky showed up. He showed up. 28 to 25. One of my highest scoring games in a wide, a long time. All right, guys, man. Until next time. I'll holla at you, dudes. I later. All right, then. One. Till next time, we say so long from the bayou.